It's called, the character trait is listening. Listening. Simeon's name means hearing. True to his name, Simeon listened for God's voice. He paid close attention to live according to what the scripture taught. Simeon wanted both to hear from God and to see him. Oh, yay! Good job. Okay. Well, good morning or whatever time of day you're watching this. It is a later time in the morning. It's almost 10 already. And my oldest is at Christmas program practice today. It is a Saturday when I'm filming this. My husband's out hunting. Um, so he is gone for a couple days. And so I've got all the kiddos and um, we are just having a slow Saturday home. I have some apple sauce that I'm going to freeze and I need to take care of. I immersion blended it already, had it cooking through the night. So the house smelled wonderful when I woke up. Um, I will be having my oldest dropped off, Nevea in about half hour or so. Um, so now he's having a snack here. Elias is down for a nap and it's just been kind of, like I said, a slow morning. So I just thought I'd pick up the camera and bring you along today. I hope to wrap some presents later today. And um, I don't know what else we're gonna do, but my life kind of just seems when I show you things, it's a lot of routine, a lot of the same things, but that is the life of slow living, being home, being intentional. And I enjoy that and I want to share that with all of you guys. So it's the weekend of Christmas when you see this video. So Merry Christmas <laughs> to you guys. But I'm going to take care of this applesauce, probably read a few books, right? Do you need some more snack? Okay. So we're going to do some of that. crazy how little marks happen to get on all the covers. So I'm going to use a Norwex and get a little wet and wipe off some of those little marks. It's truly incredible how often you can wipe things down and they get grimy again. But life as a homemaker is such as that. It is something that is a job that should be paid, right? Uh, anyways, this is just something I thought would be good to take care of, getting some grimy fingers. And then I just, I think I was looking out for it. So I just started doing it all over my house on all the different walls. And the perk of a small house, as your homie say, is it really does not take very long to clean a lot of the walls off. So none of my kiddos are napping. Elias took like a 20 minute afternoon nap here. 
So um, I just got some laundry folded. I did some magic erasing all over the walls, as you saw. And then I just wiped down some of the walls with some water and a microfiber cloth. And some of the baseboards, you know, the perk of a small house, you can do most of all that within like 20 minutes. So it's amazing. I recommend small home living <laughs> just for the sake of cleaning. It's so wonderful. And then that way you have less clutter. So um, my plan was to work on a video for a little while here while everyone napped. But like I said, no one's napping yet and it's a little after one. And then I think I'm going to make shepherd's pie potentially tonight when it's just the kids and myself. I don't know if this is any of you ladies when the husband's away i don't feel like i need to work up such a fancy meal i don't know why but i still think i'm going to I have leftover mashed potatoes i have hamburger in the fridge um raw hamburger that i need to um, brown up then i could just throw in a mixed vegetable bag and then call that good with some tomatoes in it or something to make it a little more saucy but that might be supper tonight or I'll do sourdough pizza since we didn't do that last night. So we'll see what I end up making, but I think I'll still try to work on editing a video here a little bit. Still finishing my coffee from this morning. So we'll enjoy that. And then I'll probably even make a latte later too. And the girls want some hot chocolate. So I enjoy spoiling them with that, especially because we get our raw milk delivery today. And we're actually getting some friends milk too. So we'll have to go take that over to their house because they're gone and leave it in their fridge for them. But that's kind of the day for you. My husband called and he won't be home till late, late tonight because he hasn't gotten a deer yet and he's still hoping to get um, another one here. So it'll be um, another day and night without him and he'll be back late, like I said, tonight or midnight or later, something like that. So I'm gonna quit jabbing and work on my video. I do have a Hallmark movie going as well while I folded the clothes. Um, this is the only time of year I really watch Hallmark. So it's, you know, those cheesy romances where you know exactly what's gonna happen, but they're kind of fun. <laughs> So I think all the kiddos are actually sleeping right now and it's 2.45, which is kind of late, but I might have to wake the oldest in a little bit. It took them so long to fall asleep for some reason today. Um, but I got a little more cleaning done in the living area because I didn't do that yesterday because we had some stuff going on when I usually clean the living room on Fridays. And I used that little pilling machine. I'll link it in my description box because I just got it on Amazon. It's wonderful for shirts and furniture and just things that have pills on them blankets whatever you need it for i think it was like 10 15 dollars something like that i have the hamburger in the skillet with some onion in it because i think i will just do that shepherd's pie probably throw in the extra squash i have extra acorn squash and put in some veggies and call it a meal 
and that will be super simple. And now I'm just gonna relax which is sometimes an odd thing for me to say. So I'll probably do that, relax during nap time for a little bit here before our milk delivery comes and before the kiddos wake up and life continues. got delivered I started some yogurt with a half gallon already and then we already went and took over our friends milk and took care of some other things at their house and now I'm gonna start some hot chocolate for the girls we have Christmas music playing on the TV they're dancing and we'll enjoy an evening here before I get more supper rolling and it's about 420 so I'll have to start working on that pretty soon so that I can get it baked in the oven as well the kiddos are down for bed my husband did not get his deer but he was with my brother and his brother my brother got his deer so they are processing that and then he has a two-hour drive home so it's gonna be late for him um, but I got all my Christmas wrapping stuff here I'm gonna do some wrapping I have not done any yet but we don't give a lot to our kids like two items because they get quite a bit from grandparents um, and we just don't need to add a lot to them but then I have gifts for like my husband's relatives and my family so I will be doing that the next week here and so I'm going to turn on a Christmas movie do some wrapping and just relax so the five o'clock hour and till bedtime is kind of just like um, on demand for me right now uh, the toddler is very um, needy at the moment they're just you know they go through phases and so I know it's just a season with them and they will grow out of that and there's just parenting things that have to always be done so that's just life right now and then when uh, you're single parenting it's more challenging especially during um, just emotional times for kiddos but anyways I hope you enjoyed today and that you guys will have a wonderful and Merry Christmas. Mm -hmm.